Hey boozers, how you guys doing? We're still brewing. Holy crap. So what do we got going on? I got this boiling, but I still want to drink more beer. That's right, I'm still drinking. So, we're going to do another Modern Times beer. We're going to do the Blazing World. This beer is the stickiest of the icky. It is a blast wave of dankness. A luxurious, hoppy, amber-loaded, impotent quali uh, qualities of such Nelson Savon, Mosaic, and Simcoe hops, which some are the fruitiest, most pungent hops. Sweet, sweet money can buy. Despite its amber hue, Blazing World is pleasingly dry, supporting or sporting a lightly bready malt backbone that serves as a platform for the huge, complex hop profile. All right, let's get the sucker to open up and poured. I know I'm pouring it into a wheat glass, but you know what? I'm trying to watch this boil at the same time. Not easy to do. So, we've got 11 SRM, 85 IBUs, and a final gravity of 1.008, which brings us to a yeah, 6.8 alcohol by volume. The smell. Oh yeah, that smells like some dank hops for sure. You got some earthy nose hops, a little bit of a sweetness hop, Kind of a small fruit back note, but more of the earthy note. And as we see here, dark golden down to a light golden, depending on the size of the glass. Three fingers worth of head, beautiful, absolutely beautiful. Just about boiling here, so I better get drinking. Cheers. Oh, oh yeah. Have a little bit of an alcohol bite on that. You do have an earthy sort of sweet, malty, hoppy note. Really interesting. It does have a sticky note to it. You do have sort of like an, like I said, an alcohol sort of note as well as you're drinking it. It's got that sort of flavor behind it. But the hops are there, they're prominent, they're beautiful. It is easy to drink though. It does have the alcohol sort of thing, as I said, two times before, but it doesn't have the burn as you go down your throat. It does have the stickiness along here. It does make your mouth water a little bit, and it actually is damn good. Wow, okay, now I am starting to understand what these modern time spear fans are all about. I'm actually starting to get it for a score out of 10. This is an 8.5 out of 10. Really good, really delightful, easy to drink, not a lot of alcohol burn, but lots of flavor. And that's what I love looking for in a beer. Well, it sounds like I'm about ready to boil here, so I'm gonna get back and start throwing some hops in there, get my beer going and enjoying the day. Till next time folks, I'm PK saying cheers, stay frosty and we'll see you real soon. If I don't get drunk off smelling all that and drinking all this. Have a good night. Thanks again.